Hey guys, this is Mario Freak 1989 and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Cruise. So anyways, last time we finished all of we, we battled Team Rocket Team Rocket in the um the well and we battled the, the we battled the next gym leader and I'm gonna show you guys my gear. As of right now, today is Thursday, but the wrong time because remember, um if you guys saw probably from part four or five or was it four or three or something, that this is actually this was done when I started, when Daylight Savers was still going on, so that's why that's like that. I can't switch it. I think I can't. But anyways, so I'm going to show you, and also on, on the border, you can tell I've got my second badge. I, let me make sure. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I got my second badge, so yeah. But anyways, yeah, so we finish up Team Rocket. I don't even know if we battle... And this is Guy, I'm, you know what, I'm going to give him one of the balls so he can make a Pokeball or something. I would be honored to make make balls for you. A trainer like you. This is all I have now, but take it. And we got a Lyr ball from Kurt. You know, if you guys remember the cartoon, Kurt makes balls out of ache from acorns. But anyways. Yeah, he just said it. Collect them from the trees me. I mean I won't be using them much, but you know. But yeah, I'm gonna give him an acorn. The only one I have, which is the white acorn. So we'll come back in a day, which would be a game day equals the real day. But anyways, we're about to battle our rival now. Wait. I did that in the last part? I probably did. Alright, so let's keep going. I'm actually looking for the next member of our team. I think it's going to be in here. I still don't have repels. Perfect. Actually, I just reminded myself. Oh, I am doing the right thing. I want to bring him up to a level 17, 17 and all, so... So yeah, oh yeah, that flash AM. I still didn't get an HM slave. I'll get one eventually. So let's talk to this guy. He's gonna stop. Oh no, he's not. Oh man, my boss is gonna be steaming. The far fetch that cuts trees for charcoal took me took off took off on me. I can't go looking for it here in the I Elix Forest. It's too big, too 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 big, dark and scary for me. Wimp. Yeah, so let's go find- Ugh. Let's see, is it a new Pokemon that I want? And look for that Farfetch of his. Oh, there it is! Hey, Farfetch! It's the missing Pokemon. And you gotta you got make him go- You gotta keep, like, making him go a certain way. But I don't remember how to do it. It's been a long time, so let's see if I can know how to get him to the trainer. Uh... I think this is the way. Let's see. I'm gonna go that way. So I know at one point you gotta, um... You gotta go a different way to make him go. I think I just screwed up. Yeah, I'm cutting this out. Cause I know what it's gonna be. Anyway, so yeah. I made a mistake there. So let's make him go back that way. Let's take him this way. He'll go down. I know at one point you gotta go a different way. Huh. I think if you talk to me, he's gonna go down, I think. I know at one point you gotta change a different way to make him go a different way, where it's gonna be going around in circles. And we gotta revive. So let's make him go up this way, because I'm not sure. Ugh, god, yeah. So anyways, we make it, I think it's gonna go up. I think I just made him go around in a circle. Yeah, I did actually. Actually, let's see. Let's pick him go back down. Oh god, damn it! Sorry, I'm not even talking. It's just I'm really trying to figure this out without this annoying. So let's make him go back this way. Oh my god, this is getting annoying pretty fast. I'm sorry, I'm just really thinking about this, because I know you gotta make him go a certain way. And my god, if these Pokemon will screw off! Okay, yeah, if he hits that, that means he's going the right way. Oh, there we go, I did it. Wow, just as I did it, too. Alright, we're done. So, let's talk to him. Ah, my Farfetch. You found it, first kid. Without it, we wouldn't be able to... 
cut trees for the charcoal. Thanks a bunch. Now, um, how can you? How can thank you? I know. Here's this. Take this. And we got HMO one, which is cut. Which I need to find a Pokemon to give it to. Actually, yeah, it's cut. I think someone on my team can learn it for now. Let's see. I hope. Let's see. I don't want to give it the Totodile. Oh. Oh god, I'm in trouble. Um. Oh Jesus, Char. Um. Oh god. Okay, you know what? I need a Pokemon that can do cut, and I wish I had a. Oh, uh, this ain't good. See, I'm gonna go look for a Pokemon that can do cut. Maybe that Toke. No, I doubt it. There's gotta be a Pokemon I can use that can do cut. Actually, let me see how my Pokédex. Hold on. And Centrance all the way back there, so I'm not getting a Centrance. Uh, wait, not a Beedrill. Um, what else I've seen? Not Togepi. Sandshrew, maybe. No Wooper, no Ghastly, unknown Onyx. Bellsprout. A Bellsprout. Okay, where are they? Let's see, I am at a zoo. I don't know what a zoo town is. Uh, okay, that's thing, that's probably violent. I need a Pokemon I can do cut. Alright, I'm gonna need an attempt Pokemon for now, so I'm gonna have to go back and get a beach, uh, a, a Bell Sprout. So and I'm gonna cut this out and get a Bell Sprout, so I'll be right back. A fine one for that fact. I just found a new Pokemon that I have a spec to run into. Hop it. He can learn cut. I'm gonna use him as my TM slave for now, so you know what? Instead of killing him, let's just catch him. Her, sorry. Because I need to hop it. That, that will work fine. Oh, come on! Alright, let's just keep catching it. We'll, we'll get a Venerelli eventually, because I need him to do cut for me in Flash. He's my... Alright, so we cut a new Pokemon. He's not official on our team, but he's gonna stick around until I can get a better Grass Pokemon that I want on my team. It can it can carry away or even the gentlest breeze. It may even float all the way to the next town. And no. This is gonna be our temp Pokemon. I need to put him on the bottom when I edit this. Anyway, so let's see. Let's give him cut. He should be able to learn cut. Now let's see Flash first. Okay, perfect. This is gonna be my little ancient slave for now. And let's give him cut. What? Oh, come on, he should be able to learn cut. Oh, that was a waste. Alright, let me look around for a new Pokemon. I might put him in the PC, so give me a second. By the way, guys, I, it's a Pokeball. I went way back and I found this Pokeball. Now I'm still looking for a Pokeball I can learn Cut, so I'll be right back. Please give me a Sentry. Please give me a Sentry. Alright, guys, I found a Sentry. Maybe he can learn Cut and stuff, so I'm gonna catch this guy. I'm, I went all the way back home just to see get this Pokemon. Uh, so I'm gonna catch it, and then hopefully, if it, learns, if it can learn Cut, then I'll use him to learn Cuts. I don't think he could, but I'm gonna find out anyways. I know you can probably learn Flash. Let's see. So let's see, could this guy learn- if he can't learn Cut, then I'm gonna redo this whole recording over. When acting as a lookout, it warns others of danger by screeching and hitting the ground with his tail. Alright, so let's see if he can learn Cut. Please learn Cut! Alright, let's see if he can learn Cut. Oh, thank God! Can he learn Flash? Figures. Alright, so I'll keep the hop and the centroid on my team for now. In the meantime, I'm gonna cut out and meet you back at a, a Zulu town, or the I, the LX4, so I'll be right back. 
Oh yeah guys, since we're here, since I got cut, I might as well see what's in here, because you know right now, as I have to cut out so a huge chunk of nothing in this video, so I'm gonna get this from this guy. Roar! Please run away when I roar, but you can't you came looking. That pleases me. Now take this. And we got raw, that's raw, even though my growl already knows raw. Yeah, it's raw. Figures. Alright, I'll meet you back in uh, the Elix Forest, I'll be right back. Look guys, finally! Finally! Yes! I'm taking ten of those! I don't even care. I don't have that kind of money. Let's see. Okay, I'm good. We finally got repelled. I should have done this in the first place. Alright, and we finally returned to the LX Forest. Yeah, the LX Forest. Let's put those repels on now because they've been pissing me off on my way back here. Alright, so let's get on the repels. So I want to get through this now because um, we finally got a Pokemon, a, a, a temp Pokemon to use Cut, and I got another one for Flash, so why not? And this is how Cut works. You use Cut, and then Sentry, you use Cut. Bam. This right here, I remember it's used for events to catch Celebi. Yeah, it's used for events, which I'm, which happened a long time ago. That's all dead now, cause you know. What's this? Alex Forest overgrown. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Anyways, we're going to do the Alex Forest, and now I have to make up for all that just happened. I have to literally go all the way back to the route before, uh, after a uh, new Bark Town, just to find a cut Pokemon. Someone tells me there was a bit in a Pokemon with cut, like a Paris in here or something. Antidote. Alright, so we got an antidote. Good. Anyway, so we're gonna actually search through this forest a bit, because right now I have to cut out a chunk full of nothing. And we found an e another. I think that that actually brings up in Pokemon's ba attack back up. Halfway or probably fold it and repair. But well, that was fast. Let's get another one back on. I unless you like in the newer ones where they ask you to put another one on instead of yeah, going back into it to put it on. Anyway, so let's go talk to this guy over. I think he gives you headbutt, but I'm not sure. I think this guy gives you headbutt. Let's see. What am I doing? I'm shaking trees like using headbutt. It's fun. Here, you should try it too. And we see TMO2, which is headbutt. Which I might give it to Central, because I'm not going to use him on my team officially. He's going to be my HM slave, probably. So let's give him that. Let's give him headbutt. I think either that or the the uh, the hoppet. Eh, let's give it the centret. All right. Now I'm gonna show you show it off what it does. So if you Pokemon could could be in the tree, you wanna headbutt it. So centret headbutts it, and you can do it and get a Pokemon. But you know if I do that, we'll be here all day. Let me try one more time. All right. So no Pokemon. All right. Because you can get Pokemon out of these little trees, like uh, Heracross. That's what, what I remember, really. Sometimes it's Sentry, stuff like that. But anyways, what does this guy want? Oh, crap, a battle. Fine. Shit, I'm 26 minutes in. I have to cut out a shit ton of, of this. Another bug trainer. Fine. Oh, a ladybug. A ladybug. -ba. A ladybug. A ladybug. And it's really weak level, so let's, um, let's burn it. And it's super effective, so it's out. I could have bought charcoal, but you can get it free. I th oh shit, actually, I have to go back and get it. Because uh, if you give him a charcoal, his fire attacks will increase. Which I have to go all the way back for that. Which I don't feel like it right now, actually. I'll probably do that in the next part, but for now, I just want to make up for this video because I have to cut out a lot of stuff. And we took out his ladybug, and I didn't. Eat, I haven't seen that Pokemon before. What my my Growlithe? A Pokemon I've never seen before fell out of the tree when I would use Headbutt. I ought to use Headbutt in the other places too. Wow! So this is basically introducing Headbutt and stuff. And you know what, guys? We're finally out of here. If you talk to her, she gives you sweet scent, I think. Oh, honey, you making a Pokédex? It must be hard if Pokemon won't appear. Try using this TM and with TM12, which is it was just Sweet Scent. See Sweet Scent. All right, so let's see. My repel world off. Oh damn. Oh my God, another battle. Fine. This is where I do my training. 
Alright, whoever you are. Who's this guy? Oh, is it y yumps Youngster Samuel? Alright, fine. Ugh, ratata? I'm cutting this out. God. Alright, so Rattata's down. God damn it. I'm getting sick of seeing Rattatas. Give me something good. Oh, a Sandshrew. I think I've seen it in battle, but you know what? I'm just gonna fight it, I guess, and keep it in just to show you what it does. So if you bite... I'm just gonna stick to bite. Alright. Defense curl. Fine. So, there's a chance he might survive this next bite attack. Maybe not, thank god. Are you gonna level up to 17? Almost there. Alright, next. A Spiro. Okay, we already seen those, so I'm cutting this one out. Alright, he's down and he goes to level 17. Now I'm gonna switch out. I think Pidgey needs to get level up, so let's switch. No, it was toted. Alright, let's go. A level 8 Spearow. Great. So I'm gonna cut this out. Actually, I'm gonna show Mud Slap before, and it doesn't affect him. Never mind, I'm cutting it out. Alright, Spiro is out, finally. Alright, so Sammy was defeated. Beaten by a passerby stranger. Yes, you have. Give me your money. Oh, what do you want? Hi, Eskimo, this is Liz. How are, you, how are things going for you? Listen, listen. I was listening to the radio in the ruins of Af when an odd broadcast suddenly cut into the regular show. I wonder what it is. So strange. Okay, I'll call you later. That's strange because they're talking about the unknown, which we already released. But anyways, now I'm going to switch out to Total out being up top. The other two I'm not going to train because they're not staying with me for too long. Until I get another Pokemon that I really want for the attacks that I want. But in the meantime... Uh... Repel, repel. Because there's another Pokemon trainer that I want to battle and get her number. She's actually in here. I shall battle him, why not? I just got my Pokemon back from daycare. Let's see how much strong it got. Please tell me he has one, that way we can move this along faster. Well, I feel bad for that kid. Why is he in a Pikachu suit? <laughs> oh god, that's one way to torture your kid. Oh, a Snubble, new Pokemon. I uh, don't know what it does, it's a dog. I believe in newer versions, it's now a fairy Pokemon, but you know. So, let's use Mudslap. I'm gonna show off Mudslap. That's what that does. And it does nothing. Alright. How does a tail whip fail? I don't get that. Unless my toilet jumped out the way or something. If you wanna use your imagination on this one. And it's still gonna fail. <laughs> it's, weird. it's weird. Why is it failing? It's like you're slapping your tail in my Pokemon's face. And that fail, okay. Oh, he's got a berry. Figures. You had to give it a berry. Tail whip. It still fell. <laughs> you did a horrible job training that Pokemon. And it's out. Right, so why does it have to end this way? Yeah, you you better take it to a Pokemon Center. And this person here is the person I want to battle for later cause, because she gives you something good later. Are you training? Let's have a practice battle. Sure, why not? Let's see, what does she have? Oh, joy. Oh, this can't be good. So let's see if I can take it before it kills me. Let's see. It's a flying type, because it flies with this... What the... No comment? It can, apparently it can learn... Apparently it can learn Splash, even though it's not a water type. Oh, their Tail Whip work. So, scratch the crap out of it. And level 17.
Alright, so what's next? I'm gonna switch out anyways. Another hop it, so I know what growl if it's your turn. Or Pidgey, your turn. I think my Toadah's close to evolving though. So let's just gust the crap out of it. Super effective. Kill it in one hit. I'm gonna end this part when I get into the next town because I'm making up for what all that crap I have to edit out. A Bulbasaur? Oh god, guys, here's the first Pokemon of Pokemon ever. Bulbasaur, the one that the Pokemon nobody chooses. And I mean that by far, nobody chooses this. <laughs> and Pokemon red, blue, and yellow. Tackle. But this person, you want to get their number, at least for me, because if you're looking for a, a, a Glass Stone later on in the game, because this, this person gives you it. And there you go, Gina was defeated. Oh no, I just can't win. So if you talk there and get her number, you're too strong to be a practice partner. Um, whenever I see a strong trainer, I want to battle their, their, to be their cheerleader. When I'm on my walk, I sometimes pick up items. If you get any, if I get anything, I can, you can have it. Want to give me your number? Sure, why not? I'll call you as soon as something, anything come up. And we got Gina's number. We're gonna need her. So I'm gonna need her for grass stone from, from later on from her. And I'm really trying to get to the next town, but you know. Sure, kid. He's the best. Okay, so uh, we're almost into the town. When I get in there, we'll end it. So I didn't read his name. Oh, Iron. Alright. Oh, a new Pokemon. Mankey. Mankey. Monkey. Mankey. Fanky. Whatever. So let's just mud slap it. Why not? I'm just trying to destroy his accuracy so he can start missing, even though Lair didn't miss and destroyed my defense. And it missed because it's because the mud, thank god. And the monkey is out. I forgot to switch to Pokemon, I just noticed that. A Diglett, let's give this to Pidgey. That looked it really weird. That animation. Anyway, so when he gusts the hell out of it, it's not effective, but it's enough to get it down. Well, it's dead anyways. Doesn't matter. Sorry, faint Pokemon don't die because you know Nintendo logic. And he's down. All right. No, there's. They're b they are better trainers. No shit, kid. Okay, so yeah, I forgot to switch my Pokemon to a Pidgey up front. And we're actually gonna go in here because I think you get another egg. Talk to these guys. I am the daycare man. Do you do you know about my eggs? I was raising a Pokemon with the, my wife, and Susie. We were shocked to find an egg. How incredible is that? Well, wouldn't you like to say? Then fine, it is yours to keep. And we get another egg! We wanna keep that around. But if the trainer didn't want the egg, I kept it around. Oh, we got our next egg, which I'm gonna reuse the same egg animation that I had before. <laughs> I'm gonna battle this person, go into town, peel up, and I'm gonna end this part. I'm confident in my ability to raise Pokemon. Want to see? I, want. No, I didn't battle that security guard. I'm gonna battle him too, cause I'm just all over the place with these battles. Ooh, new Pokemon, Psyduck. He's a Psychic type, Psychic in water, I believe. Well, he's a duck, so the water part comes into play. Well, let's just gust the crap out of it. All right. Okay. Quick attack is. It's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's good it's attack if you want to attack first, but you know, I don't like using it because it doesn't do much damage. And he scratches me. Okay, so the Peach, the Psyduck should be out. Alright. And Pidgey goes to level 18. Alright. I want. I forgot what Pidgey evolved into a Pidgey Yoda. I think, was it 18? Let's see. Oh, good, so I have to change one of the Pokemon on my bottom. Great. 
So guys, we're getting our next Pokemon, which is Pidgeotto. I have to change the border now. It should be fun. We evolve into a my Pidgey evolved into a Pidgeotto. Sweet. Actually, I think it's a Pokemon here that I really want, but you know, I might do that next time. So now that he's staying, we're gonna put Growlithe up front next. You know, I'm gonna battle that security next time because I want to heal up and end this part. I think I did enough to make up for what I've done. And we're in the next town with that horrible, horrible gym leader is up next. But we're gonna heal up and we're gonna end this part off because, well, it's already like 38 minutes long and I have to cut out a lot. Hopefully, this makes up for. I should go to 40 actually, just to make sure. So I'm not sure how much this video is gonna come out to. So you know what? What we're we gonna do? Um, no. I think I don't have the repel on me anymore, so we're actually gonna go back and see if we can catch one more Pokemon. There we go, because I think it's in this grass that I'm looking for. One Pokemon that I want to put on my team. Hmm. Come on. Let's see, if it's in here, I'll cut out till I find it. That's not it, so I'm gonna cut out till we find it, alright? Alright, alright guys, the Pokemon I'm looking for, I don't see, I don't think it's in this area, so you know what, I'm actually gonna end this off, so until next time, this is Mario Freak 19, and maybe off camera, no, I died on camera, but I'll, I'll look around and see if I can find its location, and I'll let you guys know, because there's one Pokemon around this area, I think, that I really want on my team, officially on my team, so until next time, see you guys.